the Polar Pro Gimbal Lock for the Osmo Pocket. Is it worth it? Let's find out. Hi, I'm Arnie, and here we talk about travel, all things travel related, and camera gear. If you're into any of those, why don't you consider subscribing? Just click the big red subscribe button down below. Don't forget, click the bell icon so you'll be notified whenever we put up new content. Oh, and don't forget, check the show notes down below in the YouTube description for more details. So, yeah, many of us have multiple of the Osmo Pocket adapters, accessories, add-ons, what have you, from the scroll wheel to the um, Wi-Fi base to, well, you name it, there are a ton of them. And they all have one thing in common. They don't allow you to use the case. I guess I should say you can't use the case with those ad uh, additional little add-ons on the Osmo Pocket. And that's a, a kind of a drag. But Polar Pro came up with a solution to that issue. Albeit, it's not a very budget-friendly solution, but it works. Now, of course, you can use all those different accessories and just take them off each time that you're done and, you know, put the uh, camera back in its case. But, you know, you run the risk of losing all those tiny little bits. And it's a very real possibility. They are very, very small. In case you're wondering what all that crinkling is, I'm unboxing. I don't like, I don't like unboxings. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I don't like them. Anyway, here it is. That's all there is to it. Very simple device. It not only protects the gimbal, it also protects the screen as well with this flat part down here. And the good news is that you can leave all of your accessories on and use this at the same time. This thing is made out of really, really tough plastic. Now remember I said earlier about it not being a very budget-friendly solution? Well, it's $19.99 and it's made of plastic with a little bit of rubber here to protect the screen. One of the benefits of the original Osmo Pocket case was the ease with which it, well, you know, you could put it away. It just slid it in there. It, it set itself up. You could just slide it right in there and boom, you're good to go. <clears throat> that is, if you don't have any accessories on it. Now, the first time you do this, it's going to be a little bit of a, well, it's a little fiddly, let's put it that way. You have to reorient the head, the gimbal, and then you snap it on just like that. And it fits closely here and it protects the screen as you can see here. All in all, it's a nice design and it really, you know, it kind of locks everything down. Now, the camera head itself does move a little bit in there, so it's not locked down fully. So that might be considered a little bit of a negative. And you'll also notice that there's a little bit of a gap in here. You might consider that to be a, a negative, you know, as it would allow lint and stuff in there. But I kind of look at it as, at it as a positive because you can put your ND filter on you do have an ND filter, don't you? If not, check out my review right up here. So you can keep your ND filter on there and put the uh, gimbal lock on as well. So I don't necessarily think of that as being a negative, to be perfectly frank. Another possible negative, again, I'm, I'm kind of searching for little for negatives. I don't think there's much to be negative about. The gimbal lock doesn't come down and cover up the buttons, but that's kind of the whole idea. You want to, you know, if you want to have your 
tripod adapter or something on here? You couldn't do that. Um, I just think of it as a, as a non-issue. The only negative thing I have to say about this is that price. $19.99 for a bit of plastic. It's a little bit steep, I will grant you that. But I like the idea. I like this a lot. And it's, this, uh, this is the way I'm going to be carrying it, carrying the pocket 99% of the time. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm liking this thing. Just wish it was a little cheaper. All right. Well, there you have it. Polar Pro Gimbal Lock for the Osmo Pocket. If you like this kind of content, why don't you give us a thumbs up? Leave a comment down below. Of course, click that subscribe button and the bell icon so you won't miss anything. Thanks for stopping by. We really do appreciate it. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.